from WNY News, this is First Morning Weather. Welcome back on your Wednesday afternoon. Fall like temperatures are in the fields this afternoon. Started off a little bit soggy, but those rain showers have exited as of this morning and we're seeing a little bit of clearing Allowing that sun to really dry up Watkins Glen just a little bit this afternoon. A couple of people enjoying the weather out there. A little bit long sleeves out there and even some longer pants as temperatures are on the cooler side. But we'll see a warm up going into this upcoming weekend. Right now though, temperatures really just holding right around that 70 degree mark. Haven't really rose too much from this morning. We're only at 71 in Westfield, Pennsylvania. 66 up in Ithaca. We're at 70 in Tawanda this afternoon and temperatures really are just going to stay there for much of the afternoon and cooling down to the 40s going into this evening and that's due to all this clearing we're about to see later in the day. As you can see, most of the rain showers have exited to our east. We still do have a couple of drizzles here and there, but again, it's very isolated this afternoon and a couple of clouds just starting to break up and that will continue to break up as a high pressure system we're tracking right now over the Midwest continues to slide its way over towards us, not only bringing some cooler weather our way, but also some drier weather and plenty of sunshine into the coming days. So for today, temperatures will be seeing at 71. It's a cooler day. Partly sunny skies are expected. The winds out of the northwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour, bringing in all of that cooler weather. And tonight, get ready for a dip down into the 40s as lows will drop down to 48. And that's due to all this clearing we're about to see. And we're even going to see some patchy fog developing after midnight that could reduce your visibility for that morning commute on Thursday. But the 40s don't stop there. We're actually going to see the 40s continuing into this upcoming weekend. We could get as low as 45 by Friday morning, about five degrees below average for that average low. And we'll start to see it rising. It's just going to take a minute until we get into about early next week. We'll see some temperatures on the rise. So high pressure is still settling in, starting to move its way in towards us to on Friday, going to help keep us dry and actually help keep Hurricane Lee from approaching here in the Twin Tiers. But as we track it out for you, Category 3 storm that's going to continue to, well, weaken as it approaches the north and east. And as you can see from that track, really just parallel with the east coast. We're looking at dangerous surf and even worse rip currents across the east coast. As it does approach the northeast, though, some of those clouds likely to head towards the Twin Tiers and we could see some gusty winds. But if you're anywhere on the eastern coastline, you're looking at some heavy rain and even the possibility of some heavy rains going into this upcoming weekend. But it will shift off to the north and east and out of the northeast and not really going to affect us here. Today, 71 is going to be your five degree guarantee, partly sunny, looking dry the rest of the week, plenty of sunshine. Clouds increase on Saturday due to Hurricane Lee. We could see some gusty winds. Fair skies end it. Temperatures will be in the mid 70s. We'll cool down to the lower 70s by early next week. We'll likely see showers though returning on Monday. Renata.